Before the video begins, I wanted to say a few things. First off, we're almost to 50 subscribers, so if you could subscribe, I will be super happy. We're also on the road to 100 subscribers. Uh, also, if you like the video, leave a like and comment down below what the next myth should be. Anyways, enjoy the video. The first myth is by me. Can sand go above build height in its falling state? The way I tested this out is that I built a huge water tube going up to build height. It took a while. After I did that, I placed all the kelp. The first idea I had for getting the sand into the water tube was to build a sand cannon. I made that by putting two pistons side by side and then placing tripwire hooks side by side. Then I put a string in the middle. I tried dropping the sand, but it didn't work. So the next thing I tried was to build like a like a piston pusher thingy. So I did that by just placing a piston and a lever together. And then on top I put the sand down and I would push it up. Then I would use my elytra to fly up really quickly. I was actually able to catch it, so yeah. There's footage right here of it happening. Okay, here's what I think happened. I think the sand made it above build height, but it couldn't land. I think the game realized that it was above build height, so it decided to break itself, like this. Anyways, let's move on. The next myth is, can sand go under bedrock? This one was fairly easy. I just broke down into the void, and then I placed a sand block. I was actually surprised to see that it went under the bedrock and into the void, but you, since you couldn't place it under the bedrock, it was kind of surprising. I was also thinking if water had an effect, which it didn't. Anyways, it was still a pretty cool myth. Anyways, let's move on. The next myth is, does soul sand water affect elytra? I tried this out by making a 4x4 tube with placing the soul sand underneath. And then with my elytra, I went into third person and dove down straight into it. It actually did affect it, and it actually looked kind of cool. So I tried it again using fireworks. The rockets actually did have an effect and brought me down a little bit lower. So, pretty good myth. If you want to see more videos like this, consider subscribing and comment below what the next myth should be. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video and have a good day.